Hi, this is Craig with Sokata Grove, and I'm here with Valerie today, and we are going to be tasting the Thousand Fingers Banana. Um, this is a very unusual banana. Uh, most bananas, when they form the flowers, they start off with uh, female flowers, and they go through some hermaphroditic flowers, and then male flowers down at the end. So you only really get fruit where those female flowers were. Uh, this cultivar just produces female flowers and keeps going and will this this will continuously grow and you'll get this big long column of these tiny little bananas and they go till you cut them off and so you have to cut them off at some point so that they'll start uh, working on ripening these up and you'd think that this was probably just kind of a novelty thing but I've tasted some of these before and they're actually really really good um, they are small. Uh, you're not going to make a banana split out of these. Unless it's a tiny one. Anything. Well, you could, you could maybe Jenna Marples could do one for her hamster. <laughs> Mine but just tastes like a grocery store banana. This one, I had one that was ripened on the stalk, yellow on the stalk, and it was so sweet. It was like, it was like, tasted like banana bubble gum. These are good. They're, they're, they're a little bit sweeter than a grocery store banana, but not much. They're pretty yeah. close. Um, That's why I say grocery store yeah. banana. If I was, now the next one of these, I'm going to let more of them ripen on the tree. Um, we tend to pick them when the very first, the very top ones start to turn yellow. Once the top ones... We cut it off and the rest will ripen indoors. And uh, you can eat a lot of these bananas now. They're good. Um, but could be a grocery store banana in texture and flavor and everything. Um, this one's a little fatter. Let's see if it's any different. I'm about the same. Good. Yeah. Banana flavory. Um, but, well. We've had better bananas from our It's like a grocery store banana, but the, but it's got a little more of a banana. It's not much sweeter. A little bit sweeter and just a little bit more banana flavor than a grocery store banana. But not by a wide margin. Yeah. The one I had that was ripe on the tree was by a wide margin it was different it was it was like candy these these are case these are ones that were green and have ripened indoors and so they're not uh, not that much different but they're still good it certainly is it's it's a novelty if you wanted to have your guests with plates of miniature fruit um, but they're good they're not bad, you know you could maybe instead of little frozen bananas on toothpicks, you know, chocolate dipped them in. Anyway, um, the plant itself is uh, medium height, uh, nine feet maybe, is it about nine feet. Yeah, ours is neglected though. Yeah, we don't have ours in a really. Uh, it's not on much irrigation or anything, but um, and it is. It's neat to see because you get this this huge column of uh, bananas growing. And uh, you wouldn't think they'd even be edible, but they are. They're, they're pretty good. So, anyway, that's the Thousand Fingers. Um, it's, 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 it's in my top ten, I would oh, say, nice. of bananas. Yeah, I mean, well, and, and part of that, too, is on that other one. Like I said, the one I had right from the tree was phenomenal. But, um, yeah, but these are still good, and it, it is cute. And that's just kind of cute. candy flavored. <laughs> Well, yes, but I haven't come across a cotton candy flavor. Or what you, you yet. said yours was like extremely sweet. So that one on the tree, yeah, it was, it was, it was, it was really good. Yeah. If they were all like that, I'd be planting a lot more of these. Maybe but, they will be when we take care of the plants better. And again, maybe I would start just eating them as they ripen off the tree instead of cutting the whole hands off and just taking a few hands at yeah. a time as they ripen, and then you get make get them that much sweeter. Mm -hmm. But um, anyway, very good and. Um, Thanks for watching.